teach technique on how to put two pieces of clay together, make sure there's no air pockets in the clay that would cause it, you know, a piece to break. I believe there's over 20 different classes. Uh, really search who that individual is, you realize that everybody has the potential to be very creative in their own right. Essentially, I think what an art teacher does is push them in one direction, but kind of let the student go after that. Figuring out what they want to accomplish and then showing them how to accomplish them. or not, maybe not aspect, but time periods through all work. So I think every subject can be incorporated by the art. After I create an artwork, I just, I feel so good about it. And it's great to see other students feel the same way after they accomplish something that they didn't think they could. For the most part, it is kind of a sanctuary, an environment where they can get away. No matter what, what art class it is, it's kind of the, the safe place. End result isn't always as important as the process of making trials and tribulations. The project itself is something they enjoy. They don't realize that they're problem solving or trying to accomplish something that's very difficult. What is progress? Is it progress in thought, creativity, idea, technique? in a certain amount of work with art, you could equally get something in return. I think the real journey of becoming an artist is inward. I think you find out a lot of, about who you are as a person. This is artist life. It's you know something that happened in our lives, and we can create all work because of it. Everything we try to do is for AP portfolios, you know. So we're always trying to raise the bar, if you will, to uh, on the creative end and uh, everywhere. It's a part of our life, and has been for since we came down out of the trees and started running around, drawing on the cave walls. <laughs>